Hello, everyone. Hope everybody had a great week uh, and a great weekend. Um, I had fun reading you guys' drafts. You guys have done a great job um, kind of synthesizing your ideas and getting your theories out there. So um, keep up the good work, as I always say. Um, I'm going to be going over this upcoming week, so the week of October 12th through the 18th. Um, it is 3.5. We are rolling through this semester. Um, so if you go to Blackboard on the 3.5 module, you see an intro with some videos to watch. You see your, your plan for the week. You have some things to read, some videos to watch, and then you'll see the things that you have to do um, this week. If you scroll down, um, you'll see you have a revision plan that you'll turn into this link here. You have a before and after that you'll turn in here and then you'll have a reflection that you'll put on your portfolio. So these are the three things that you have to do. Um, you can do them in this format here, um, the way that the module suggests that you do them. I've also um, created a doc um, that you can kind of incorporate if you want to do it in this kind of format. Um, however you want to do it is fine. Um, by the way, I'm wearing my Tar Heel hat today because um, this is the first school that I went to to get my bachelor's degree. University of North Carolina. I'm from North Carolina and we are actually relevant in football for like the first time <laughs> really in my lifetime. Uh, we're 3-0 so I've decided to wear my Tar Heel hat for this video. Uh, anyway, um, so this is kind of the, the document that I've used to synthesize all the assignments for this week. Your first assignment is a revision plan and you only have a day turnaround for this. Um, but basically all you're doing is um, in, in one or two sentences for each question, um, you're just answering these questions. How am I going to incorporate the feedback I received last week? You should have received feedback from me and from your peers. Um, which suggestions am I going to incorporate? And then which suggestions am I going to ignore and why? So you'll answer these three questions and then you'll turn that in to the revision plan um, assignment portal there. Um, and that's due tomorrow. Uh, Monday, October 12th at 11.59. And I'm going to go ahead and add PM to that. And I'll add PM to this too. Um, so tomorrow night, um, just answer those questions and turn that in. Uh, then you have your before and after. So this is how you're going to revise one of your paragraphs. Um, you can do more if you want, but you're only required to do one for this assignment. This is going to be due next Sunday. Um, so you have, if you do it this way, you can just do it in a column format. Um, or if you do it this way, you can just do it um, kind of in um, uh, a text format here. Um, but you're going to start with your before paragraph, and all you're doing is copying and pasting um, one of your paragraphs from your draft to this section. All right, so that's all you're going to you have to do for that. Um, for your revision plan for the paragraph, um, you are going to um, basically cr create a numbered list or just explain um, what you plan to revise according to the feedback you received uh, in your own goals. So for example, you could just have a numbered list and then say this paragraph needs more support for my arguments, it needs more sentences of discussion, and then I need to figure out good transi transition sentences um, for my paragraph. So something uh, really light, just a, a few um, uh, suggestions. Um, or, or an explanation of what you plan to revise. All right, so that's your revision plan for the paragraph. And then you're going to revise your paragraph and you're gonna put it under the after paragraph section, all right, or column, whichever um, format you decide to use. So in this section, you'll post a revised version of the paragraph from the first section, and we should be able to see there's a change from the first paragraph to the, to the second paragraph, all right, the before to the after. And then finally, your revision analysis. So in this section, you're going to write a brief analysis of your revised paragraph. Maybe it got better, maybe it got worse. How whatever happened in the paragraph, that's what you're going to um, write about in this revision analysis. One or two sentences per question, or you can, instead of writing it as questions and answers, you can just write a whole paragraph that addresses all these things. Um, what did you accomplish in your revision? What is the difference? Uh, what is different between the two revisions? Uh, is the revision better? If not, why not? Was the revision successful? Uh, and then what do you think are your next steps for your project? A successful revision, I feel like um, if you think it's successful, then that means that you think that 
um, you made it better. All right. And so why did you why do you think that you made it better? It kind of goes into this this question here. Um, but you can just so you can just kind of uh, combine these two questions if you want into one question, however you want to do it. Um, so that's going to be due next Sunday. Um, along with um, all of your before and after stuff. All right. So this is all part of your before and after um, revision of your paragraph. All right. And then finally, your reflection. As always, post it to your portfolio. Give me a link to it. Um, you're going to answer these three questions. What was the overall effect of the feedback? Um, what are some characteristics about the feedback that helped you the most and the least? And then how is revision based on feedback from peers different from revision based on self-feedback? Okay. So you'll answer all those questions. Um, that is it. That is all you're going to be doing for this upcoming week, 3.5. Um, if you guys have any questions, as always, let me know. If you want to meet for um, office hours virtually, send me an email um, before your day, and I will meet with you at the um, at the allotted time. All right. Hope you guys have a great upcoming week. I look forward to reading your revisions. Uh, take care. Be safe.